Hey guys, what's up? It's Ends here, and uh, today I'm in this video. I'm going to be showing you how to make your hand um, and any other uh, kind of body parts uh, follow a object or rig. Um, so pretty much what this does is if I um, want to move the gun and I want my hands to stay, it just stays with it I can move anywhere and they will not they won't um what's it called they won't move away unless of course uh limit it's reaching the limits of the rig and things like that. So um one thing you need to know before I start is that um you need to have an IK rig. I don't think this is achievable with FK because um of the way the rig works. So um yeah, let's get into it. Alright, so, um, so I've, uh, moved my hands away because this was a rig before, so I just got rid of it, um, so, yeah. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is, um, click the main burn, um, which controls the whole gun, um, and, of course, you're going to have all the bones which are coming from the one end of that bone, so you want to go into edit mode, and, um, in the at the end of the bone which all the children are coming from you want to press E and move it across right click the whole bone alt P uh, disconnect bone move it across to the grip um, and just move it out a bit I guess you don't have to do that but I like to so you can press uh, press shift D again uh, move it out a bit and um, you can call these anything you like, so I'll call this one wrist, uh, I'll call it wrist grip, and I'll call this one base grip. So, um, now we have two bones which don't do anything at all, and, um, we want to connect these, so it stays there, and when we move our gun, it will follow. So, you want to click the bone which moves the arm like this and um I think I'm pretty sure this only works with IK rig sorry so if you're using an FK rig um I highly recommend um searching up how to IK rig um there are heaps of tutorials on that around um and yeah so on the bone which moves everything around you want to click, make sure you click on it go to the constraints uh tab add a new but, um, constraint and click copy transforms oops <laughs> copy transforms and for the target you want to have uh, the whole rig so this uh, this is called um arm armature because I haven't named it yet can be bothered um so that's arm armature and the bone is the base the one I made just now so now it's going to stay there, and um, the inf if you don't want it to be influenced and turn it down, you can use that for maybe sw um, swapping out to a magazine or something, so uh, that's that. <clears throat> and you can do the same for the wrist, so add a copy transform, the armature, and the wrist. Oops. And now it will follow, so if I just position this. North and crispy. Uh, I'm just gonna do it roughly for now. Give you an idea. So now, if I move the uh, gun, it follows along with the hand. And um, yeah, so you can make shoot and everything. Now you can do the same to the mag. I mean the yeah the mag the handle. Uh, the charging handle, um, and pretty much any other part that you find, um, uh, you know, any other part that moves with the hand. And yeah, that's pretty much it. I mean, uh, it's not that hard. Um, so yeah, if you have any questions, I'll always reply 100% of the time. Um, 
and yeah thank you so much for watching i hope you have enjoyed this video if you have then um yeah please subscribe it really means a lot to me and also liking so it comes up on a when you search for the video so people other people can see this as well so um yeah thank you v2 <laughs>